Hey peeps, Phoenix here, we're continuing on with Chrono Trigger. In the last episode, we defeated the rest of Magus' goons, including Ozzy, who pretty much held on a hole in the end. And this episode, we're going to continue in finding Magus and defeating him ourselves. Uh, okay, last time I had a bat friend, didn't go so well. Oh, but they are building up. Really? Oh, I'm out of MP. But they're dead. Oh, I think I should go up and... You know what? No. No, we're good. We're good. We'll just... Oh, no, I didn't want to switch. Just use some meters. Oh well, seems to be all right. Get this started. Magus! Aye. It's that stupid frog. Kissed any princesses lately? I'd rather enjoy this form, and I owe it all to you. I have something for you! Masamune, but you're just dying to use it. The black wind begins to blow. Okay, give me your best shot. If you're prepared for the void. And here we go with our fight against Magus, and as far as I remember, this is going to be a tough one. I don't remember anything he does, I don't remember anything he'll counter, I just... Wait, only fire damage? Jeez. I love the music that plays, though. Yeah, so... Wait, only water damages. Ow! Okay, so... This is already very bad. But if only water damages, then if we... Have you do Aura Whirl... And then... You use water... There we go! Alright, only lightning damages, and Chrono can do that part. Oh, he knows all the two attacks. Alright, come on, come on. Just use lightning. There's no combination for that, so just slurp Chrono. Only shadow damages, and we don't have anything with shadow! Frog is gonna need to be healed. Uh, 
Okay, so this is pretty much a round where we're just gonna have to defend, because none of us know shadow attacks. Oh, do they really have to do that creepy laugh in the middle of all this? Okay, let's see. We'll do Aura World next chance we get. What would happen if I just straight up attacked him? Uh, it doesn't do a lot. But the Masamune did decrease his magic defense, so that means when I get a chance to use magic again, I'm gonna be able to do more damage. For now, though, just Aura World one more time and attack him again. Only shadow damages. Come on! Okay, once we get a chance, we'll try an X strike. Wait, why is our health depleting? I just saw it slowly trickle down. Okay. Um... Alright, seeing him do that, I'm gonna assume only lightning damages. Okay, that attack doesn't. That's what's doing it! Oh crap, the geyser's a death counter! It's alright, it's alright. Uh. Lightning? You just. Actually, you can... ooh, ooh, that's good, that's good. The next turn we'll use an aura world. Yeah, okay. So next turn we'll use an aura world, and then we'll also have frog attack again. Water. Okay. okay, so long as he keeps it on water, I'm not going to complain. However, I'm going to be daring, and I'm going to have both Marl and Frog do ice water. See how much damage that does. Um, combination... Where's it at? Where's it at? Where's it at? Then just use an item. Hey, Tonic on yourself would actually be the best thing. Nice! Alright, so if it's water, both of them can do a double attack. Do that again. So a bit of tonic on frog. He's not switching the barrier for some reason. Just risks casting. Oh, uh, what? What? What did he do? Tonic on Marl. Wait, he's charging up. Oh crap, I didn't notice he was charging up! I'm just gonna have Chrono ready on standby. Dark Matter Knight. Oh no. Okay, that's actually a cool attack. But wow, did it hurt! Okay, that's bad. That is bad, that is bad, that's bad, that's bad. Okay, then we're just gonna slurp. We are in way too much damage. Oh! Heal is a group. Okay! Wish I would have realized that sooner. I always assume heal is just for status ailments, but clearly I was wrong. Oh, not again. But wait, 
If if uh, Frog uses the Masamune, will that stop it? No, it will not. But seems like regular attacks work. Come on. Then Slurp Pet. So it seems like he's not putting up the barriers anymore, but either way, that attack of his really hurts. So if we just keep our healing up, we should be fine. Attacks. Ice sword. And I guess just regular sword cut. summoned him! He lives in the inner earth, absorbing the land's power and growing ever stronger. What? What's going on? The gate! You... If you hadn't shown up... Chrono! Whoa! You'll be late for work. I'd forgotten how beautiful Lee's bell could sound. Chrono, we can't keep sponging off my dad. Go out and get a job. What's happening? Chrono! 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 Strange dream. Went to Mystic Mountains. If you would lie there, hurt. I carry you back to hunt. Magus! Yummy frog. For Zela eat? Perish the thought, lass. By the way, whither the blue haired one? Only find you there. Blue haired one more tasty? We have lost him. But if Magus didn't create Lavos, where did it come from? Lavos? Don't worry now. You rest. Hurt bad. Quo 
Put it okay now. Zillet busy. Look for Laruba village. Fight reptiles together. Destroy reptiles or we no survive. What happened? Quiet. Quote rest. Don't wood burning. Oh. So. We fought Magus and somehow ended up in the past? But the north wood is on fire, huh? This time we're going in the right direction. Oh. Well, no, what? No. I know for a fact we don't need the weapons. The ones we stole before when we were here were the ones that he would give us. So we're fine. So the north wood is on fire, huh? Um. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm doing it again. Is it this one? No. Did I screw up again? Uh, okay, I'm going to leave. I'm going to leave, because I am screwing up again. No. Then maybe... Oh, yeah, okay, we're in the right spot. Tikino, you're that's all who fight. What do now? Reptiles follow Zela. Zela Badlock. Uh oh. Those who fight killed. Uh oh. Zela, it's not your fault. It's your fault. Look at mess. Reptiles followed you, so village now ruined. Zela, feel bad. Red Tide strong. They live long time before us. They smart, so we hide. But Zela say fight together. Zela still fight. Zela fight while alive. Win and live. Lose and die. Rule of life. No change rule. Old man breathe, but dead on the inside. Zela, you strong. Can make big talk. We know her power. No, have power. We fight. Gain more power. Zella help you, but need Dactyl. Give Dactyl. Need Dactyl? Go to Tyrone Lair? That's Reptite's place. Dangerous. Zella won't die. Want to live, so go there. Zella be okay. Give Dactyl. Okay. Go to Dactyl's nest and Keeper will help. Careful, Zella. Thank you, old man. Whoa, 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 okay, um, just walked in on that, but considering she's one of my favorite characters, I think we should go in and make sure she doesn't get herself killed. And we've already seen this area! God, I still feel stupid about that. Oh, also, just, um, so we can have a little bit of a mix. Yeah, this... wait... I'm trying to think this through. Oh, I forgot what party I had beforehand. Was it... Was it... No, no, okay, so... Alright, so we gotta put up with these freaks again. If I can get my thing set up. Wow. And he is somehow still alive. The reason I shot that rock was so it's weaker, but now we gotta kill it right away. Because if you cut off their top and you let them live, they're going to do a lot of damage. Ooh! Antipode. I have no idea what that is. Ah, I almost forgot I had a run button. Ah. You know, the worst part is, this is the area I grinded because... 
as lost as I was getting, I didn't notice the hunting ground. So I just kept coming into this area over and over and over just to get the materials for items we never even used in the end. So, yeah, I was really stupid. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Did we, um, get a new weapon for Luca while we were adventuring in the castle? No, we didn't. All right. Oh, but we did get new ar armor. I forgot about that. Alright, so we gotta traverse through this nightmare again. I say nightmare because I still can't believe how bad I got lost. When it's straight up said, follow the footprints, and I go the opposite direction. That was me being extremely stupid. Yeah, there was no chance I would have avoided this. Anytime now. Uh, what does Anaphor do? Oh! It's an attack! I kinda wanna see what this does, so I'll wait. Thank you! Wow, that took way too long! Whoa! I wish I would have done more damage, but that actually looked kind of cool. Oh man! Kind of hoping they learn more skills, because I don't think I paired them up with each other for a while. And then these rocks, I can easily just run by, so I'm just gonna try and dodge them as often as I can. Really? Why is it taking three attacks to kill you? We should be getting close to where we need to be. Ah, here we go! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Wait for us! Wait for us! Chrono! You can't be serious about going alone. No, Tarono lay dangerous. Maybe all perish. Listen, we owe you one. Right, Chrono? Zela have strong friends. We're all going to the Tyrano Lair. Convenient that there were more pterodactyls. Alright, so now comes the decision of who else do I want to bring with me. I should bring a magic user, so I'm gonna help... Ah! Oh, but wait a minute. Well, everyone knows a little bit of a healing spell. As much as I love Robo, I'm gonna keep him out again, because he and Zayla already were together for a while. Let's go ahead and keep Marl, why not?
fun! We can actually fly around! Although, we're really only going to be going towards the one location, but hey! If we really want to, we can just fly around for the whole time. And if we wish to land... Just press A, and there you go! Alright, though, but... Uh, I'm not getting new stuff, I'm just going to show off what he sells. If I remember where to go. There we go. Oh, right. I suppose I need to get him new stuff. A dream gun. Don't really need since we got something already, but why not? Do a petal. Horn. Get a dream bow. Again, we don't really need since we stole it. Petal. And feather. Get a magma hand. If anything, we get stuff we can sell. Fang. And horn. Aeon Blade, again, we already got it. And then one more. So yeah, you don't really get a lot out of this still, because if you did what I did and ended up grinding till you learned charm, you get the items anyway. But it's nice to show off what you can get out of that. For now though, let's head over to the lair. Which is way more highly sophisticated than anything else we see in this time zone. And here we are at the Tyranno Lair. And I feel like this is a good spot to end the episode. So, next time on Chrono Trigger, we will enter the Tyranno Lair and try to fend off the evil found within 650 million BC. And I will see if I remember the right buttons. Let's end this off properly. I'll see you guys in the next one. If you guys have any random questions, pop them down in the comments below. Till then, see you guys next time.